surprise that's what being funny is all about believe it or not it's surprise surprise i'm telling a joke surprise it's a twist ending surprise you didn't expect that so something that's unexpected a surprise that's what makes a joke so if you want to be funny you have to surprise people and that's uh, i'll give you some examples oh also rejection is another thing um i can't believe you said that that is a sign of rejection um oh no that's another sign of rejection when people say that when you say something that you think is funny then you're on the right track even though they might say oh i can't believe that oh you didn't do that no you didn't yeah that's all rejection and that's a good thing if you're going to be funny because that just shows you're on the right track so surprise the unexpected so for instance i have several jokes that are like my favorites and i tell jokes and i am funny to people and in circumstances because it entertains me so i really don't care if people laugh or not and i really don't care if people think that's pretty crazy because uh that's just i really enjoy entertaining myself i sit here and laugh tell myself stories all the time and it's very funny because if you can see the humor in life then um, things don't get too serious for you and that's a it's a very important uh, fact in getting along with things that come up because life is not always funny but if you can see the humor in it uh, it keeps you uh, keeps you going so uh, a priest, a rabbi, and a minister walk into a bar, and the bartender says, what is this, some kind of a joke? <laughs> All right, so I like jokes that are a story just flat out. I also like when somebody's talking about something, and then you could put a little twist on it, and then um, it kind of like uh, makes that, makes them laugh. You, you want to, the, the main function of being funny in in life and with other people is to bring them up a level in their day-to-day -day world i mean they're in a grind and they're doing their stuff and it's just kind of like a routine and they're almost hypnotized as they go through life they're just everybody is like that and they're on autopilot it's just automatic and when you say something that makes them laugh and takes them out of that it just kind of like wakes them up it gives them life it's a it's a it's a boost in in their life you're actually doing them a favor i went into a supermarket one day and as i was checking out i was putting my food on the on the cashier's counter and a stack of a uh, package of toilet paper at the end and i asked the lady do you think this is enough toilet paper for this much food okay. now that just like she couldn't believe i said that it's rejection she was surprised i said it it was unexpected and that's what makes it funny so she left and she woke up and she had a little burst of life in her day so uh you're doing people a favor when you're when you're funny um and you really will enjoy it and it is a big boost to your life too because you just go ah got her it's so funny so uh yeah i just like that stuff i'm not talking about professional comedians because they make this a science and they're um they get really into it um and it's it's a very tough profession and it's a lot of work and it's there's so many factors to telling a good joke and entertaining people professionally that you the common person cannot do that but the common person can uh brighten somebody's day and brighten their own lives by just seeing the humor in things 
I mean, I'm not talking about laughing at people when they slip and fall down, but it is, um, it's, it's funny when you, uh, can lightly <laughs> tease people. Uh, for instance, my favorite knock, knock joke. You, you walk up to somebody and you say, I've got a great knock, knock joke. You start and they go knock, knock. And you go, who's there? And they just go like, Uh, it's hilarious <laughs> okay well at least for for me it's it's funny and i really do enjoy that so tell your jokes um and bring a smile to people's faces uh it's it's a uh, it'll brighten your day and you'll really appreciate it i got a couple more but i don't know i don't want to like uh overstay my welcome here but uh <laughs> I'm just thinking, see, I'm just thinking of these jokes and they're making me laugh. Uh, okay. I'm sorry. Guy walks into a bar with a dog, sets the dog up on the counter, and he says, My dog's a talking dog. I, I could make him talk. You want to hear him talk? It, it will cost you a beer and so the bartender says okay here's here's a beer let's hear the dog talk and he turns to the dog and he says uh -huh. what's on the outside of a tree and the dog goes bark and the guy goes what's on top of a house and the dog goes Oof. and he says how does sandpaper feel and the dog goes Oof. Bartender gets so pissed I grabs them both, throws them outside. The guy's brushing the dust off himself and the dog turns to the owner and says, What did I get him wrong? <laughs> I love it. Okay. So uh if you like this <laughs> If you, like this, <laughs> if you like this video, click the surprise. <laughs> the subscribe button. <laughs> and I got a free gift. <laughs> click on the link and get the organized mind because <laughs> it's it's a free gift. <laughs> and it'll make me laugh if you click on it and get the get the book. And remember. Some people are like slinkies. They're not good for much, but they bring a smile to your face when you shove them downstairs. <laughs> okay. Make it a good day. Bye.